Hello and welcome to a Tabletop Bellhop Cardboard Coat Check. I am Mo Tuzano, the Tabletop Bellhop, your cardboard concierge, working with you to make your game nights better. Today, what we're going to do is crack open this box and let you know what's inside and let you see for the first time, this is the House of the Dragon Touch the Game from Escape Welt. This is a high-end escape room puzzle, uh, wooden, uh, looks like it was laser printed originally, already assembled, that you try to solve by getting into the box. I don't quite know what to expect, but I do have to thank Escape Welt for sending this along, sending a review copy of, uh, of this and a couple other boxes for us to check out. From what I understand, once you solve the puzzle, this becomes an awesome gift box. So I happen to be recording this just before the holidays, so I think it's going to be a really cool thing that if I can solve it, maybe I can put something cool inside, like a miniature or something, and give this as a gift for someone else to solve to see what's in there. But before I can do that, i got to open it up and see what this actually looks like. And all I can see right now is a set of doors, and it looks kind of neat. No, this is not man to be a, I'm not going to sit here in live stream solving the puzzle or anything like that I'm just going to kind of show it off so that if you decide to go pick up a copy of House of the Dragon from Escape Welt which currently is only available in the German store but it's coming to North America which is why we got a copy of it um, to know what you'd be getting and to see if the price is justified so first off it's going to be getting this cardboard off but first I want to show off what exactly like the box looks like so it's got the escape out logo in the name um then we get the the side where you can kind of see the gates and so you can see the puzzle in there uh nothing much else on the box like this is more just cautionary stuff right i did not check this qr code and the box is just a box so not a lot of information on what you're getting in here then we're going to crack it open all right, let's see if we get a little more information on what we have here and exactly how you use it, because I have no idea. So this was handmade by Vladimir, and that is literally written on, like someone wrote Va Vladimir there. So Vladimir put this together. Thank you, Vladimir. Um, there's a whole intro here. Hi, I'm Bubo. It says, I'm incredibly happy that you have bought my toy. I want you to know that all products of Escape Welt are handmade and consist of many small, complex mechanisms. The raw material I work with is wood, and it is a living material, which is influenced by external factors, and it can also happen that our toys become damaged during transportation, delivery, etc. Unfortunately, we can't envisage and prevent these moments, but my technical support team and me, Boo Boo the Mummy, we always treat our clients with great love and care and basically if there's anything wrong contact them it's made of wood wood can get damaged um, then there's uh, some some qr codes to their socials here we have the actual house of the dragon oh it's like it looks like i should turn that this is in multiple languages we have just a little pamphlet what do you feel when the people you love hurt you Loneliness, anxiety, sadness, all these emotions tear your heart apart and make you stop trusting people. That was the story of our old Japanese friend Asahi. Since his youth, he was working 12 hours per day as a carpenter to give everything to his only son, Ryoto. But as soon as Ryoto turned 18, he left his dad to study in Tokyo and never came back to visit him. It's with a depressing story here. Years pass and Asahi learned that his son got a family and the carpenter's grandchildren already go to school. That was the moment he had been waiting for. Asahi took his paints, brushes, and started to draw and daydream about how his family would reunite. Accidentally, he fell asleep and the dragon came to his dream. It said, don't cry over your grandchildren. It's not too late to build a strong family bond. When the dragon disappeared, Asahi immediately woke up. On the table, he saw the scheme of a wooden toy. All night long, the carpenter was working over the project. As soon as he finished, somebody knocked at the door. It was his family. Asahi couldn't believe his eyes. He immediately told them his dream and asked to see asked to see look at the new puzzle he made. The kids couldn't solve the riddle on their own, only thanks to the older ones. They finally opened the box. Family members realize they are strong only when they are together. Thanking the dragon for the wise lesson he gave them, he named the puzzle the House of the Dragon. So kind of silly fluff. All right, here, here's the big moment we're all waiting for. Oh, it does turn. I'm trying to think. I don't want to damage anything. So that's it. No instructions, just boom. Here's your box with a silly, rather silly story. Okay, I got to say I'm impressed. Like, just look at some of this stuff going on here. Something's happening inside. 
Oh, you got a dial here? Okay, I'm gonna turn some of this. So you can turn this dial. Different things are showing up in the middle, pointing to different symbols. Um, on this side are some doors. Oh, there's like a handle here. Oh, wait, something's changed. Oh, I turned the top. Okay, I don't wanna, I don't wanna, again, I don't wanna solve this. So this spins up top. I was able to turn a piece here to open something. I'm assuming you're trying to open the doors. So there's various wood cut, ton of dials on this side. Do these turn? Oh, they pull in and out a bit. And push in and there's, there's obviously a code here. You can hear stuff inside. There's words on the bottom that look like I should probably hold them in a mirror. Uh, there's a button here. Obviously it has an elastic or something to it. All right, so there we go. I, this is a nice chunky box. It's got a nice feel to it. It's a little hard to describe uh, like without you actually seeing it. Definitely well assembled. I don't see any broken bits. The detail's really nice. Like look at the, the Kieran here with the, none of that wants to slide. Like I could probably sit here for an hour just playing with this thing and, and y'all could watch, but I don't think that's what we want to do. The, the fact this turns on its own is just neat. And oh, now this popped out by turning it. All of a sudden there's this sticking out this side. I don't know what's going on there. So yeah, here you go. This is what you get in a the Escape Welt House of the Dragon. Touch the game. I was amused by it. Touch it. Touch the game. Uh, a escape room style puzzle. A escape box. Um, I'm reminded of uh, my dad had a traditional Chinese puzzle box back in the day, and I'm reminded of that. Was this already poking out before? See, I don't even remember. Anyway, I, I just want to play with this now. I just want to sit here and do this, but I'm here to unbox it. I did that. Um, you can put it back in the box. Oh, see, now this piece is sticking out. It doesn't want to go back in the box. So i got to figure out if I can get this to turn back in. Uh, nope, not how it's current. There we go. If I turn this there, I can put that back in. Sorry, that was kind of funny. Goes back in. Ridiculous story. Boom. Oh, I didn't put it in the right way. Let's fix that. Ta-da. House of the Dragon. Escape Welt. All right, there you have uh, what you get in the box for House of the Dragon, a, a mystery puzzle box, escape room box. I've heard them called a few different things from uh, the company Escape Welt, which is from Germany, a high-end wooden puzzle that I got to say is just fascinating. I just, I, I don't I want to turn the video off and just go sit and play with this thing and see what I can figure out. As um, soon as you touch it, they, it says right on it, touch the game, you want to. You want to start, as soon as I noticed that the roof twisted, I wanted to play with it. Um, very engaging, very neat. Uh, quality seems excellent, seems well constructed. I got to say the little story it came with was a little odd, but sure, it's a thing. Um, so we are now working with Escape Welt. They sent us a review copy of this. And as a bonus for anyone watching this video, if you go to us.escapewelt, E-S-C-A-P-E-W-E-L-T dot com. So us.escapewelt.com. You can use the code bellhop to get an additional 10% off if you purchase anything from their store. So I got to thank Escape Welt for that too, because that's pretty cool. We get this awesome puzzle to play with and we do have a discount code. Um, in the future, I will be trying to crack this open and figuring it out. I'm probably going to do it with my kids, um, though I'm tempted to just, you know, keep it for myself and try to solve this thing on my own. And when I do that, I will be sharing pictures and so on on social media. I'm sure I'll get some as I open things up, but I don't want to spoil anything. I'll make sure to be, to, you know, keep the spoilers to the side. But I'll be sharing that on my social media feeds where you can find me as Tabletop Bellhop. One word everywhere. We'll eventually be sharing and talking about the game on the Tabletop top bellhop gaming podcast which you can find on your podcatcher of choice and of course sharing a written review on the tabletop bellhop blog tabletopbellhop.com i'm really looking forward to it. like seriously this is hard i just want to shut all my videos off and everything right now and like go in a corner bright well lit corner down in my game room and play with this thing it's neat very very neat very well done a very solid oh i like it it's very cool Thank you for joining me for for this recording. I am Motuzno, Tabletop Bellhop. Good day and game on.